I'm if you didn't want you. And I'm Sam. This is Maggie, our dog. <sighs> yeah, she's our and dog. Today, we're good. We're gonna be talking about a tank. It's okay, man. Yeah. You can just hit okay. the floor, okay? No, Anyways. Okay. No, no. Anyways. Um, I have a cooler chair than Sam. So no, no you no yeah I do. No you don't. I, I do. No you don't. Ah! What are you doing? Eating a one of a kind of delicious apple. <laughs> Weird. She loves me. She just loves me. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, today, I would to see it a lot is because my comfort, she likes to make up, make, like, you know, have you ever heard of the bass bed? Bass or fish, the bass bed? Um, hey, hey! What? I was just getting so, a tissue. Yeah, um, she's trying to make a clownfish bed, I guess, if you will. That's my starfish. I had a little piece of bubble allergy. So last year she, you know, piece from the gravel. Um, also like, the score right here, as you can see in the last picture I'm showing you right now, that's what it looked like a long time ago. Now, in a few seconds, I'm gonna show you the huge difference. What a change. It has gotten so many more anyway. branches on it. It's just totally been doing really well, so I'm happy because that is a hardcore of the key that is guess. Okay. Cancel. So <laughs> what? Um I'm thinking about getting a boyfriend for um Chief, my clownfish. I found them for really cheap on liveacquire.com. I shouldn't say cheap, I should say inexpensive because they're, they have good quality stuff. But, um, yeah, because if you haven't heard already, New York Stilo's, um, doing a giveaway if you get your conference to spawn. I'm getting MP60. I mean, MP10. So, but I want MP10. I don't know about you, but I really do. So, if you're doing that, then game on. Game on. So, yeah. I think that's about it. My brother actually has a tank. Um, up, it's going to be later upgrading to a a turtle tank. A turtle, turtle tank. tank. Um. So yeah, he's gonna tell you about that. Oh wait, Sam, what do you think about my tank? She just got in the trash. I'll be right back. Ready? And here's the next segment. Down here. Okay, yes. Now, I'm going to show you my tank. And um, there is a clam that I caught in Mud River by Sanford Pond. And a uh, live plant. <coughs> a goldfish. And a turtle. Um, I am planning on having a tetrafauna tank and get getting four more turtles, four more baby turtles to put in there and um, let's go check it out. Here's that clam and then the turtle, Turt, that's his name, short for turtle and then that's the live plant right here and then goldfish he is very shy, oh, but so let's try. He's a spotted goldfish back in there. Uh, I'm planning to put in it the tetrafauna setup. Um, I will be um, getting some more species of turtles, as in the red-bellied turtle, um, the cooter turtle the yellow belly turtle and the musk turtle and then I'll have five and um, I'm planning on using this long piece of wood that goes up there um, 
from my tank from my two salamanders I'm going to get for them to climb up there and tan on this light. And that is my old T5 light with one blue and one white, some reflectors. It is a bit longer, but um, it okay. works very well. But I'm not going to stop there. I'm going to put in two toads that I'll catch at my grandma's woods. And I'm going to put them in here because they say toads and frogs are good for the tetrafine too. So that's what I'm going to do. Thank you. Okay. Um. Hope you enjoyed today's show. And if you have any comments about my take, I'll be glad to answer them. Mm -hmm. Um, Sam is here. You know, usually you guys just count it like, whew, it's awesome. You know, I like that. But I also see some things that how you would guys would like me to improve. Because with just saying that, whew, it's awesome, it means I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. So if I'm doing anything wrong that I don't know that I'm doing wrong, and you, but you guys do, please tell me, um, so I can, you know, upgrade to better. So yeah, um, my do time. Nah, peace. Nah, kind of, kind of like that. Yeah, one, two, two, three, peace. You didn't do it right. It, yes, I did. I, I did it right. You didn't do it right. Yes, I did. I did it right. I. I can tell. Hey, that's Didn't my dolphin. That's my dolphin. Right. That's my dolphin. That's my dolphin. Ah! Dolphin. Ah! Ha! Ah! 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 Peace. Hey guys, what's up? Tiffy did would you? And today I'm gonna be showing you how to view my new 3D videos in 3D. Okay. So as you see, this video called Outro made by Refex Streams. It's now in 3D. So all you have to do is click on the 3D button. Now click on the glasses. Very awesome and change it to whatever type of glasses you have for human 3D. It's, it could be red slash cyan, red, you know, blue, red and green, and magenta, and blue and yellow, or if you have a 3D TV or monitor, just click one of these. And an all 3D viewing device means you have to do cross-eyed and stuff so it looks like it appears 3D. So yeah, just click that, and actually this video here is kind of funny, it's just a video in 3D, random video, it happens to be Coke Zero and Mentos. Jeez, these guys look stupid, don't they? Okay, anyways, um, let's take it back here. Anyways, um, yeah, also... One other thing that would help is, you know, you can change it to full color. Um, you can swap it from right to left. Um, you know, you can do whatever you want to make it look 3D for you. Um, also, one thing that will help, I'm sure, is if you click 3D and then you or you click 360p here and you um, click 720p HD you watch the complete quality difference from here to there and look at just look at that I mean the quality is so much better um, that will that will help um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video I hope you learned how to do my 3d videos um, so, yeah, that's it for today. Peace. I'm so